will not serve it. The Kuntas are here on Char. They have been for some time hiding. Kuntas commander, it was folly of you to come here, for I am Kerrigan, and I am Queen of the Zerg. I know of you well, O oh Queen of the Zerg, for we have met before. I am Tassadar of the Templar. I remember your selfless exploits, defending humanity from the Zerg. Unfortunate it is to see that one who was once so honorable and full of life would succumb to the twisted wiles of the Overmind. Do not presume to judge me, Templar. You'll find my powers to be more than a match for yours. In fact, I sense that your vaunted power has diminished since last we met. Mayhap, a queen. Or is it only that I need not flaunt my power in such an infantile test of will? Foolish Templar, prepare your defenses. I will come for you soon. Kerrigan, I sense something strange about this Templar. Perhaps you should reconsider your attack. For the last time, Zars, you question my motives and authority at your own peril. You dare threaten a celebrate? You'll be the doom of us all. Anyway, folks, welcome back. Um, had a little bit to drink tonight, and this is the first time I've done a Let's Play after having a couple of drinks, but, well, <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Anyway, welcome back to StarCraft. So, apparently, Tessadar and... Yeah, I think I jumped the ball a little bit. We don't know for sure that that's actually doing. Starting the Protoss Intruders. Kerrigan must survive. No, no we don't. Alright, well anyway, that's Tassadar. And he's basically the Protoss guy that we've been fighting. Like, even as the Terrans, we were fighting against him. And he made a remark, you know, about Kerrigan and what was going on on uh, Tarsonis when she, you know, stayed behind because Minx abandoned her. Basically saying he admired her for what she did, but, you know, that it's unfortunate that she's become a, uh, an infested Terran. Let's move you to this corner here. Now, this is the, I think this is the first mission where we fight the, as I call them, the dreaded, uh, Scarabs. But, on the plus side, we get Guardians, and Guardians are pretty awesome. They're actually, they're the, they're basically air assault. Um, they cannot attack air units, so if, you know, you have a bunch of wraiths or scouts going at them, then they're kind of screwed. Or, if, you know, if it's a Zerg versus Skurd. Skurd? Clearly, I am drunk. Actually, I'm not really drunk, but I'm just tipsy. But anyway, uh, the Scourges, they are also good against them. And the way you get them is, the, uh, Mutalist can evolve into them. Let's get some Overlords, because we're... Now, uh, this is a supposed theory, and this is also kind of me testing this theory, is that I actually play games better when I'm drunk, or have at least had a little bit of alcohol in my system. So here we are, finally testing this theory. Damn when I was checking my text messages, you cowardly little schnots. Um, oh yeah, and then there's, uh, Kerrigan also has the psionic storm now. Which, um, the, the uh, High Templar hat, but I think hers is, like, enhanced or something. Not 100% sure. One moment, folks. All right, we're back. Sorry, I had to send a text message out right quick because I just scored a date. That's right. I don't know if I've mentioned this in any of my videos, but I uh, went through a breakup. It, it was mutual, so, you know, both parties were kind of okay with it for the most part. Um, it did, it, well, yeah, I mean, there's no harm in getting into it because we pretty much agree that it's over and I'm not going to disclose any names, so it's not like... My ex will know. Oh my god, he's referring to me. Yada, yada, yada. Um, we basically just agreed that it was better off that we pretty much be friends. It was one of those things where you had too much in common with said girl. At least that's how I felt. Um, she didn't exactly tell me how she felt, but 
I kind of she she did kind of imply that she was okay with the breakup and that we could still be friends, which that's how it's gonna go. But this was about a month ago, give or take a month ago, a month and a half ish. So yeah, you know, I'm like, okay, I'm kind of over it because I'll admit, at first I was kind of like, eh, this is tough. I want to go back, but I know that going back would be a mistake. So I stuck through with it, and lo and behold, uh, here I am now. Getting on another game. <laughs> so we'll see how it goes. Wish your uh, good friend Luca. And I consider all my subscribers good friends, especially you, Master Hammers Man, if you're even watching this. <sighs> see, I confess things when I'm drunk. That's, that's something you should know. I shouldn't say drunk, I should say tipsy. Right, and I'm falling behind now. I need to get a, another hatchery, and I want to build it close to my geyser. Provided my drones will let me build it, and they did. Good on them. Okay, creep colony, you become a sunken colony. I want the lava. Like that. I need to reset the rally point. Come here, you three. And even when I've had a little bit of alcohol, that, that freaking noise that the hatchery makes still sounds just bad. Okay. Let's make a creep colony if I can find the hotkey. Ugh. I'm almost done with these long ass shifts too. I think I've mentioned them before in some of my videos where I've been working like these extended shifts basically. Uh, they're 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 nothing short of a pain. They're not hard. I shouldn't say that they're hard, but they are a pain. They are kind of annoying. Yeah, I prefer not to be on them. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Got some extra minerals here and with a geyser. Holy shit, there's a lot of it. There's a good chunk right there. Uh, might be an idea to get that. Actually, yeah, we can. We can afford it too. Just need to get a layer so I can actually get up there. Or can I just. No, I need a layer. Fair enough. Fair enough, game. Fair enough. Actually, hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. Okay, good. So making sure the game was on full speed, basically. Make that a layer. All right, let's get some zerglings. Make you a sunken colony. I guess now that I remember that I can also make guardians, because it's been a while since I've played StarCraft, but uh, now that I remember that I can make guardians, they're also a pretty good offense or defense. One moment, folks. Sorry. Girls can distract one's mind pretty well. Uh oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, <laughs> holy shit. Uh, that thing's about dead. So I'll leave these guys just kind of chilling around here. You two as well. Damn, man, those guys really laid into me. You three go over hither. You two become drones. You research that. You, this one. I'm going to need you later. I need to make some evolutionary chambers. Chamber and you to make me the same. Meh, see, meh. Okay. My poor building. Even though it sounded like the, um. The oil things from, um, 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 um Warcraft 2. 
That's another game I really want to do a let's play of. Alright, you just kind of chill up here. mission I said I was going to use the spore colonies, but I actually didn't. Transport. Oh, we got all the hydro this upgrade. Oh, wait, I can make a hive now? Wow. I didn't realize we were so far in the tech tree. Alright, so you three. Some drones. Probably one there. And yeah, buildings take a bit to heal. As soon as that finishes, I'll send my guys over there and we'll start another uh, little area. Pop that there. Pop another one beside it. And then we'll slap a queen's nest there. I believe the queen's will What? What's precious? What's yourself? minerals, I didn't realize it. I do not know! Actually, how much does a spire... Oh, okay, that would be why, because the spires cost a crap ton. I really did not realize that. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, let's cancel it. Let's cancel one of them, at least. And I guess I'll just get make, have him make, like, an extractor or something. Come on, upgrade, hurry up. Finally. Okay, we'll unload there. You become a hive. For now, you guys shall be group one, just so I can have like immediate response to either side of getting attacked. You build an extractor, you build a hatchery. And then you just fly away. Oh, sweet. Sweetness. Alright, now I just gotta wait a little bit. Let's just make a few more zerglings. Yeah, I'll send these guys on a little scouting mission. More hive tunnels, then. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Scarab. A Reaver. Go down, you damn blasphemy mother. Uh oh. 
I saw something flying. Saw transport. What did it drop off? Aha! Ooh, 7,000. I might actually need to think about capturing it. Ooh, my head's done. Sweet. Actually, yeah, get to those. Okay, Spire, upgrade that. Let's make a few more. Mutas. Muta wings. And a Hydra this. You three there. Become a creep colony. Go and make hives because that's what's required to make the advanced fire, which I'll show you in a bit. You actually start going there. Let me see something. Yeah, good enough. I'll make another one. I'll turn him into a sunken colony. So that way we can at least hold that place until our, like, flyers can arrive. <laughs> Blimey. I do say, old chap. Blimey. Four dogs are not playing games. To uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Snickerdoodles. That was my mistake. I lost the building. Blimey. You, I have need of you. Thank you. 
Fly away. Well, at least now I can make guardians. Depleted of Espin guys, uh Actually I'm gonna need to use your parasite ability down here the And many guardians were born that day. Look at all of them. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That was like 12 there. Holy shnit. Alright, my guardians. Rally together. We must destroy them. At all costs. Actually, truth be told, if I can just take out the Reavers, we'll be good to go. Oh, we're going to be pushing for a two-part video. Of course, I'll probably be doing the second part when I'm actually sober. Just saying. <laughs> Get it, Machina. Just saying. Shut up, Nappa. Holy crap, here they all come. Holy schnick.
my guardians. Say they better have pulled a few from that group. Else I'd have been, you know, WTF and like, whoa, where the fuck did they get all those dragoons from? Dragoons versus guardians. Who shot them in? Well, they still have better firepower. I've almost got that place taken care of, so it's all good. Let's go ahead and get some more drones. You come hither! Actually, let me make sure this is still clear, or if they actually like put a guy back there. You good? I'ma be mad. So far it's clear. Yeah, I see it's clear. Rampage. Yeah. Mission complete. 
Let's see what else we can soften up of theirs. God damn it. Oh shit. Come Hydras. Or never mind. Alright folks, well that's been this video, so I'll see you all soon for the next one. And we're back. And our guardians are returning. Still, they did pretty well. I'll give them that. They performed admirably. Imagine I'll need a fourth one. Hmm. Yep, that'll do. Six underway. Let's get more zerglings. All right, my guardians. Let's go soften them up some more. Shall be control group one since the original control group one is dead. Or oh wait, no, no, it was control group two. Never mind. No matter, you're still control group one. God damn it! Where are you at, you annoying little schnit? Oh my fucking god! Oh my god, god, oh my god! Okay, we got lots of upgrades being done. First, let's group up so everybody's cut up with Oh, wait. That's right. I say, fuck you, overlords. But fine. Have it your way. I'm gonna sleep like a baby tonight. Thanks to bear. Duh. Okay, finally. Matter of fact, why don't we strike it down here? And the battle is on.
And my guardians emerged on top. Oh, not quite, not quite. Oh, you bastards. Aha! Good grief, how many of these damn things do they got? Freaking uh, what you call it's around scarabs. Seriously, compared to scarabs, I will take siege tanks any day. Ha ha! What now? 
not test it out. Was there something that I missed? Nope. Where are you, Tassadar? Do your underlings always do your fighting for you? This shall be our battleground, O Queen. Face me here, and I will defeat you myself. Alright. Kerrigan, it's all up to you. <laughs> Fight him fair and square. You guys just, you know, chill. You did what you had to do. Coward. He's afraid of me. He saw what I did. Hell, he saw what I did, and that made him scared of Kerrigan. So, ha! Hmm. 57. Not bad, not bad at all. Lost one building. Hmm. Well, then, folks, I shall see you all soon.